from the Lord bless you. This is Purpose and Marital Bliss with Pastor Honorary. Thank you so much for stopping by. If this is your first time, please do subscribe and make sure you click the notification bell so that every time a new content is uploaded, you will be notified. Do like the video and share with your friends. Amen. Today, God says, I should tell you, look within you, there is more. God says, look within you, there is more. We live in a world that we have been made to believe that life goes in circles. You are born, you grow up, you go to school, get a job, and then you get married and have children, and then you raise them to go to school to and get their own jobs, and the cycle continues. And at some point, we are asking ourselves, is this really all about life? Did God just create us to earn a living or to struggle to make ends meet? God says no. God says there is more. There is more to you than you think. There is more to you than you know. There is more to you than the society has labeled. God says there is more. In the book of Genesis chapter 1, the Bible says, God created everything and validated that it was good. And when he got to Genesis 1.26, he held a meeting with the Godhead and he tells them, he says, let us make man in our image after our likeness. He says, and let him have dominion over every other thing that was created. That was purpose. It means he created everything, but when he got to man, there was purpose before even the creation of man. Man already had a reason for being into existence. My interest is that when we get to Genesis 2 verse 5, the Bible makes me to understand, I'm paraphrasing, that the vegetation had not grown because God had not caused it to rain and there was no man to till the soil. So we see in Genesis 2 verse 7, God forms the man and puts him to till the soil. So my interest is that, so after everything that God created and saw that it was good, none of it could be manifested physically until God was in collaboration, God was in partnership with man. God had a role to play, man had a role to play. The man did not come before God started thinking what to do with him, no. There was already a role for the man to play. God says, I should tell you, there is something you are supposed to do in this world that you are not doing. There is something, stop looking at yourself to be small. It says there is more to you. There are treasures in the inside of you. There are potentials in the inside of you. There are solutions hidden in the inside of you. He says there is something inside of you that the world is desperately hungry for. As a matter of fact, the creation is waiting in endless expectation for, for your manifestation. You cannot afford to be small. You cannot afford to be contented with making ends meet. God says there is more. Look within you, there is more. You are a solution to the nations. What is that thing you think God has embedded in you? If it has never occurred to you that there is more to you than you think, than life has made you think, than the world, than other people have made you think, Consider it today. Change your mindset and start in your search to discover that thing. Thank you. Shalom.